today I'm going to be talking about the movie called Alice in Wonderland Through the Looking Glass. Overall, I really did like this movie. And the reasons why I did like it is because there was two parts that were really funny. The Cheshire Cat was funny and also Alice was funny. The Cheshire Cat was really funny because he told jokes the whole entire time he was on the screen. And also, Alice was funny because when there was this big blue butterfly and he told her to watch her step and she wasn't looking where she was going. And there was a big door and she was like, why should I watch my step? Because she fell out the door and there was the big world and he, she fell in the air. And another part that I liked is when there was this girl and her name is the Queen of Hearts. And she had these vegetable people that she made and and they are real and she ate one of the and she ate the lady that was made out of vegetables snores or she's and she's like and it was a cure and she's like ate my snorzle. There's another part that I liked and it was an action scene. It's when um, Alice and the Mad Hatter were riding on their pets and they were really big scary pets and their hair was blowing in the wind and they were like dun 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 and they were going closer and closer and the Queen of Hearts was, had like a little magnifying glass or something that she looked and she's like hello Alice. <laughs> so I will warn you there were a couple scary parts in this movie. It was where there was these mechanical robots and they were built by this guy who can control a chronosphere and he built the robots and he and the robots are trying to kill Alice because she had to use the chronosphere. And there's this one scene that you probably think it's scary, but I think it's cool and action and action parts in this too. It's where there was there was on Hornish Day there was a big fire dragon that breathed blue and purple fire and it was really hot and it was the hearts of Queen's dragon and then there was these soldiers who um on Hornish Day and they were doing this he ho he ho he and they had silver backs with the hearts on them because they're the hearts queen's uh, players. And she, they were like this. And then the dragon swooped down and waited for the queen, the heart queen, to get on the dragon. And she had like this chain dress. It was like, there was this skirt and it was like this. And it had chains like she was the death woman. And then she went up on her dragon's foot and the dragon flew away. But when the dragon was half there, she was like, Ha 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 ha! Like an evil witch! So yeah, that's pretty much the end, and I really liked it, and I think you guys should too. There was a lot of pretty cool action parts, a lot of cool colors, and a lot of cool fighting, and like a lot of cool special effects. And um, there was probably like just a few bad language, like one or two bad language is probably how I know it's because I plugged one ear and the other not so I could kind of hear the bad language. But I know I'm not gonna repeat myself because if I do, that would be really bad. Um, anyways, uh, and so I like, Alice in Wonderland is one of my favorite stories and I really liked it. And so yeah, that's pretty much the end of my review for the movie called Alice in Wonderland Through the Looking Glass. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.